everyone, welcome to Paper Constructions. Um, I'm joining you from the library, which is located on Tree 6 territory in the traditional homeland of the Métis. And for this program, we are making things out of paper. And I'm going to make one of these little paper house plants. So this is the first one I did. A little snake plant and this one I just cut out the leaves and then decorated them using markers and wax crayons and stuck it in the little pot so that one's really really easy and this one is um, a folded paper craft for all of it so it's another little um, a little succulent plant in a little pot so I'm going to show you how to make this one today and we'll start with the pot because then you can make it in different sizes and put whatever you want inside. So to make our mini plant, you're going to need eight or so squared pieces of paper in green if you want them to be the color of leaves. And these are seven and a half centimeters by seven and a half centimeters. So we'll save that for later. And then for the pot, you need another square piece of paper. And this one should be 10 centimeters by 10 centimeters for the little pot. If you wanna make a bigger pot, of course, use a bigger square piece of paper. And then this last piece of paper I have here is going to be rolled up, folded and rolled up into soil, just to stuff inside so our plant stays upright. And this piece is 23 centimeters by 15 centimeters. But let's start with making our little pot. So we're gonna take our little square piece of paper here and turn it so it's in a diamond shape. And then we're gonna do our best to line up the two points of the diamond. And then fold it down. If you're using thicker paper, especially you wanna really make sure you push on your fold line to get it nice and flat. And then we're going to turn it so our fold is down the center and repeat the process, joining the two tips of the paper together. Like that. So now you see we have the lines like this. And now we're going to slowly do each corner to that center point. Pushing down. And then turn it. down. We're just making a little square. Kind of looks like an envelope. Now we're going to take our bottom corner and fold it all the way to this line right here. And then turn it, take this one, and bring it all the way to the corner. And again. Now we have a bunch of squares throughout. And what we're really looking at are these, these center four squares here. Let's just put a line here so you can see what I'm talking about. So we're looking at these four squares in the center. And for this part, you can take a scrap piece of paper and roll it up. I'm just gonna put a piece of double sided tape. And I'm gonna roll it up till it's the size of that little square. I can tell it's just a bit too tall, so I'm just gonna take this 
flatten it and cut it off. I'll start to fold this up and in so you have a little corner like this. Same thing here. Start to fold this piece up and in. And then there's your little, little pot. I'm going to put a little piece of tape in here to help it stay. There's our little pot. So now that we have our pot, we're going to get going on the leaves. So these are seven and a half centimeters by seven and a half centimeters. I have some in dark green, some in light green. And we're going to do the same thing a whole bunch of times. I'm going to show the leaf one more time here. Have a diamond shape. Fold it in half. Open it. From this corner to the half line. corner to this line. And this one comes here. onto itself and one more time to the center line. So we're going to turn it, take the bottom and bring it up.
I'm just going to fold up the bottom of these if you can. It's quite tricky, especially if you're not using high grade paper. If you're using printer paper like I am, it's, it can get quite stiff. Um, but once you have them folded over at least once, then you have to roll them up. Together, like this. And then you'll put an elastic on the bottom until it's ready to go. Now we have our piece we're going to use for the soil and we're just going to keep folding this one up. So this one was 23 by 15 centimeters. I just want to bundle that one up. And then we're gonna pull our elastic up. And we're just gonna roll this together. If you want, you can secure that with tape or you can just pop it right into your little into your little pot. So it looks like this. And take your elastic off. And now we're just going to your little paper succulent.